what my family, we always spend it remembering people who passed away in our family, but also, like, we're really patriotic, so we always celebrate, you know, the people who died defending the country. Do you know why we celebrate Memorial Day? I honestly don't. I think it has something to do with, like, uh, veterans and war and stuff, so I imagine it's a way to honor those people who have fought in wars. Yeah. You're right on the couple of them. <laughs> uh, so we celebrate um, Memorial Day um, as, I mean, to remember those who have sacrificed so much for our country. Uh, so we celebrate Veterans Day to, celebrate, um, to commemorate those who are currently serving our country. Um, and Memorial Day, I feel like, is for those who have paid the ultimate price for us, uh, sacrifice for giving their lives in defense for our country. Well, we go up to, like, where the Buried. Like, um, from my dad's side, we go up to southern Idaho and like put flowers on graves, and then from my mom's side, we drive down to southern Utah. It's like kind of a long drive, but it's fun. <laughs> to celebrate Memorial Day, we'll go visit the tombstones of my relatives who have passed on, and I, I always feel sad when I go to a cemetery. But we try to stay as positive as we can and just think about the think about the good memories and think about the the trials that they overcame. Unfortunately, this year it's gonna be a lot of studying, but. Uh... <laughs> Um, you know, we'll, we'll take some time to, uh, um, I guess, discuss our feelings about um, the country and things that we can do to help show our support, um, things like that. Yeah, Andrew's actually in the military, so sometimes we take the chance to go like to national parks and things like that to be able to, you know, enjoy that opportunity, enjoy the beauty of the country, and it's really, I don't know, a neat way to be grateful, I guess.